it's me, Susan Blackwell, and today I'm side by side my favorite Broadway bouquet of spring daffodils from the musical Mean Girls. Look, everybody, it's Taylor and Louderman. Taylor, tell our friends at home where we are and what we are doing mm. today. We are at the Broken Coconut, and we are eating pretty for breakfast. TM. This place is so freaking cute. So cute. I want to nab one of these hats and put it on. I think you should. I don't think you'll get arrested or thrown <laughs> out. I'm gonna put 30 seconds on the clock. Okay. And you have to tell me your whole life story in 30 seconds. Don't leave out the awesome parts. Okay. Ready, go. Okay, well, I was born in Madison, Wisconsin, and I um, started doing theater at the age of 10. And then I had four little sisters. Well, I had two, and then when I was 12, my parents got some vacation souvenirs, and they were twins four girls, five girls total. And I played a lot of sports and then I switched to high school. 10 seconds. Oh my gosh, left? Left. Oh, 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 and then I went to the University of Michigan for musical theater and then I left early. I dropped out for Bring It On and then I did um, more stuff and now I'm in Mean Girls. <laughs> <Tazza>. <laughs> oh, well what the what could it possibly be like to play the meanest girl in Mean Girls on the Broadway? Probably like Beyonce feels. Something opens up in the show. I don't want to give it away. Uh, well, something opens up and then we roll down on this table and I have to balance myself on this table and the crowd goes wild. And I try to, to really soak that in and I wonder if that's how Beyonce feels when she's starting her show too. I bet. And like you just absorb it like a battery. Yeah, like a battery. You're like, I'm gonna take that yeah, in and I'm gonna like give a it back to you all night long. I'm sure Beyonce probably has louder, longer screams, but in my oh. head, I, I pretend um, that, that you're it, it's the same thing. Like white Beyonce. Yeah, so that I can then walk out on stage and feel like Regina George, because she's very full of herself, I think. I know that you get really nervous when you know that people you know are in the audience. And girl, How do you know that? Because I do my research. I feel you. Mm -hmm. I feel you. Yeah. What the what is the most nervous you've been when someone you know is in the audience? When I was in Bring It On, I would get really nervous. I think I was just so young dealing with all this pressure. Yeah. Um, I remember they came and they uh, recorded the show for the Lincoln Center Archive. Yeah. And I got so, so nervous. And I think I went up on a bunch of my lyrics. At the very end of act one, I'm supposed to like punch the air and feel really empowered. But I came out of a lift and I fell smack on the ground. And that's what's at Lincoln Center. Lincoln Center Archives? It's so embarrassing. Check it out. Just go to the library there and... No. Oh, no. I know. Did you hurt yourself? No. I hurt my heart. It hurt your heart. Mm -hmm. But we can laugh about it now? Yeah, yeah. Line? Yeah, now I've gotten a lot better at managing my nerves. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, beta blockers are great. A to the men. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Christmas with a cow. What the what? <laughs> So I'm from a small town where the cattle population exceeds the human population. Yes. And my grandfather has two farms and he raises cattle. My sisters and I have made a habit out of doing these Christmas videos. And uh, we thought, why not make the most of where we're from? Um, small, small town in Missouri. And uh, have Christmas with a cow. My grandpa was really excited to be part of it. Roll back clip. <laughs> we're proud to spend Christmas with a cow. Christmas with a cow. The first song I remember singing was... Animal crackers in my soup. Monkeys and rabbits loop the loop. A country song I love singing is... Strawberry wine, 17. I just learned the guitar. And so as one of the first songs I, I, I did. Oh, and my grandmother likes Jolene, 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 Jolene. So I, 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 I learned it and I sent it to her. Oh, grandma. Mm -hmm. My favorite thing I sing in Mean Girls yeah. is. Ooh. My name is Regina George. You are super close with your family, mom, dad, four, four. younger sisters, mm -hmm. and they all look delicious. The name of the game is, which one would you eat? <laughs> <laughs> I would eat 
um, my little sister Morgan because she's the sweetest. Oh, Morgan, we're gonna eat you. And how would you prepare her? <laughs> how would you eat? like? I would definitely <gasps> bake her. <laughs> Sprinkle bush sugar. Yes. I love avocado toast. It's my favorite. Mmm. Mmm. It's really good. Who do you do? Who do you do? Who do I do? Like, who do I do? Well, do you do any imitations? Who do you do? Oh. You took it to the dirty place. <laughs> That's on you, Taylor. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I really like Kristen Wiig. Do you do Kristen Wiig? I, no, I do. I like the, you know, when she has the tiny hands. I do. And they're, they're like singing a song, yeah. and then she's like, and then I put it in the toilet, and I had a little turkey, and you know, or or I like the the target lady, uh, you, when she does the oh, oh no she does the I'm so freaking excited, or or she also does the um, uh, juicy boots of 1961. Any other any other voices? Who do you do? I play a little um, uh, 11 year old on uh, well 11 9 10 11 on a Nick Jr. show called Sunny Day. What's that sound like? She just talks really high. And she helps Sunny with all of her nails. And she keeps the book. And she giggles a lot. <laughs> Who would you like to call? It could be somebody from your Mean Girls cast. It could be somebody on my phone. Ashley Park. Ashley Park. In my phone. You have her number? Girl, I've got everybody's <laughs> number. Hello, this is Ashley Park. I'm sorry I missed your call. Please leave your name and number and I will call you back as soon as I can. Thank you. Hello, Ashley Park. You have missed your waxing appointment here at Bear Hair Removal. We would like to know when you can reschedule. Please call us back at this number. Bye. Approved! That's her own number. She's gonna call herself back. <laughs> she thinks she missed her bikini wax this morning. You just read Ashley Park's number live on camera. <laughs> you got any special skills down there at the bottom I'm of your resume? Uh... How about that lazy eye? <laughs> That's a pretty special skill. Okay, here you go. Just right to camera. Yeah, so it looks sort of like I'm looking at you, like one eye is cross-eyed, but the other one isn't really. Um, it looks like I have a problem. And so sometimes if somebody is talking to me about something serious and I don't want to take it seriously, I'll just nod my head and go into this sort of thing. This is the big questions lightning round. When it, don't look. I'm going to give you five seconds to explore your answer to each question before okay. moving on. God or no God? No God. What happens when we die? We join the universe in some other form. Do aliens exist? Yes. Are ghosts real? No. What is your purpose in life? To give back. Cake or pie? Cake. Finally! Yes! It's what? cake! <laughs> it's cake. Yes, it's cake. All you other... It's cake, never pie. People say pie. Everybody says pie. I don't understand. It's cake. Yeah. Guess what time it is? What time is it? It's time for Susan's <laughs> Fantasy Jukebox. I have your nose and you can have it back. But first, you gotta sing me a song. Any song, song of your choosing. I really love the Peter Pan Live song that I, I got to do. Is this just pretend? Only pretend. Through it's all just a game. Make believe all the same. Is it only pretend? I'm sorry, all these no, no, people. Keep are singing, keep singing, keep singing. <laughs> all these feelings. This has been I'm another amazing episode of Side by Side by Susan Blackwell, with my homegirl Taylor Lauderman. Do. do yourself a favor, go I see her in Mean Girls. You she is what you amazing. Never say, my friend. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you. Amazing. <laughs> Ashley 
car coming back. Should we take it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's take it. Hello. How dare. Hello. Hello, you miss you've missed your appointment and we were wondering when you were going to make it in. You need bikini wax, we know oh this. Oh my god, Taylor, I did not know you could do this with your voice. What are you talking about? What is this voice? This is Taylor's she's so drunk.